Houston copies. Yeah, says flight control team confirming everything looking good thus far. They'll be proceeding with this deployment to just under the halfway mark, where they will then pause for about 45 minutes to let the array rings warm in the sun, and that will help minimize any stiction of the uh, surfaces. A good panning view from the cameras mounted on the exterior of the complex, as you can see, uh, panning around to get good visuals of all of the surfaces. Well, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to NASA's Johnson Space Center here in Houston with our the key operations for today on the space station, which uh, was the deployment of the S6 solar rays that went very well. Uh, we didn't have any problems with it. Uh, we were very pleased with how the plan came together and how it was executed. Uh, in fact, I would uh, characterize that uh, also as flawless. The status briefing that had been uh, packed for three years, uh, I want to correct that uh, information. It was actually packed for uh, eight years. And what you're seeing here is uh, a considerable uh, amount of uh, deformation of the uh, solar panels uh, due to tension and stiction. Uh, as we had talked about, uh, there was much more stiction in the 3B solar array than there was in the 1B solar array. And uh, there you see the, uh, the, the blanket continuing to unfold, and the rest of the deployment uh, went very nominally. And uh, as you can see, as those panels release there, uh, you see waves going over the array. Uh, that's basically just uh, um, indication of the, the type of, uh, of, of stiction forces and tension that we were able to overcome. And ultimately, we ended with a very successful uh, array deploy. Thank you. Uh, the International Space Station team and its partnerships are on cloud nine with, uh, with the completion of the integrated truss assembly, as well as uh, the finalization of our electrical power grid on the space station. Uh, it took years to get here. Uh, we had some struggles along the way, uh, but it's, uh, it's a major accomplishment uh, uh, for NASA and, and the partnership team.